Welcome back to Beats of the Heart, Lyrics of the Soul. The song we are talking about today is called Crawling by the band Linkin Park. Find it in the description and in the top right hand corner of the screen. If you love music, hit the like button and hit that red button to make my heart beat for you. And I will put all of my soul into these videos for you. I want to put out this review as a tribute to Chester Bennington, the lead singer of Linkin Park, who left the world too soon due to his battle with his inner demons. I want to take a quick moment of silence right now before we get to the song review. Let's get to the music. Now the artist says this about the song, stating it was inspired by his own battles with substance abuse. Crawling, he says, is about feeling like I had no control over myself in terms of drugs and alcohol. Hence the line, these wounds, they will not heal. Knowing Chester's story, I think it goes a little deeper than that. With things that happened to him, I, I will not talk about here today, but I believe his early life led to his later life being filled with drugs and alcohol, trying to destroy something that he held inside. I've always loved this song, but after hearing of his death by suicide, it made the song speak to me so much more and understand what he was fighting while writing the lyrics for this song. This song is sung beautifully and at the perfect times to show the emotion of the lyrics, the lead singer screams the lyrics in his trademarked fashion that only Chester could accomplish. The song repeats the same lyrics a few times throughout the song. First, we get the hook. So we see from these lines that something inside is causing pain, crawling in his skin, and by them being wounds that will not heal, we get some insight into the kind of wounds we are talking about. The fear of facing the wounds that will not heal cause him to fall into drugs and alcohol abuse, messing with his mind and thoughts and confusing what is real. And then we get these lines, the something, the wound that will not heal, is always pulling at his thoughts and his mind and concentration, consuming all of his energy and confusing his mind. And the only chance of avoiding the pain is substance abuse. So the mind is at ease. And then of course we get these lines. The wounds that will not heal cause a cycle of these occurrences. He feels he will never be in control of his life again. And when he does have control, he feels so lost and can't find himself before another cycle begins to stop the cycle from starting again. And then we get these lines. He isn't comfortable in his own skin. And although he stands beside his own reflection of what he wants to be, he can't bring himself to change and become the reflection he wants to be. As much as the reflection he wants to be becomes the reflection that he is. That right there is an amazing metaphor contained within the lyrics. The only way to change and become something new is to shatter both reflections of what you were and stand in front of a new mirror to see the new you. Now, due to Chester taking his own life, leaving a wife and children in the world without a father, we think, how could someone do that? But knowing the battles he was going through in his own mind and the struggle to free himself from these battles, only Chester himself knows what happened and how he felt the anguish on his mind his whole life wouldn't end and living another day with it must have been scarier than the thought of death. Chester left the world way too early in his life due to disorders in his mind, something we can all get help with if we need it. All we have to do is gain the courage to talk about it, bring the demons inside to the outside where together we can defeat them. Rest in peace, Chester Bennington. You brought a lot of great music to the world. I decided not to do any artist information in this one. I figured if you guys like the song, you can actually look that stuff up yourself. Um, 
I will do it for older music, but this is a, a newer song, so most people have probably heard of Linkin Park and maybe heard a couple of their songs, so I didn't think it was uh, needed to do any artist information. But I hope you enjoyed this in-depth review. I would love to hear your comments and thoughts on this song or any music. Like and hit that red button so you receive my next video. Thank you for watching. Okay, bye.